the Twitch competitor Kick has been making some pretty big headlines recently, and uh, it seems like a great time to talk about it right now. Now, clearly, it does, you know, Amaranth is here now. That's part of the news. I'm not, who cares about that? Uh, it's, it's got all your categories, just like Twitch does. Man, people are watching old school RuneScape. That's incredible to see. But that's not the only thing I wanted to talk about. Big one here, Twitch star, XQC signs a $100 million deal with Kick, a rival platform to Twitch. Uh, I'm not going to go much into reading this article, but one of Twitch's most popular streamers said on Friday that he was joining a rival streaming platform in a si significant blow to the Amazon-owned site, and it's a sign of increasingly strained relationship with its content creators. Now, as we all know, Twitch has been making very dumb decisions. Very dumb. They, uh, they decided to change the split on their content creators because they are running out of money apparently and then they came out with a policy change that was very very dumb uh preventing their creators from getting other sponsorships because they're not making enough money on twitch ridiculous well the 27 year old he's chatting with his fans Hosts reality shows, broadcasts himself playing video games. He's become a star. I mean, he's younger than me. I am upset by that. Uh, <laughs> Kick is allowing me to try and do things I haven't been able to do before. I'm extremely excited to take this opportunity and maximize it. Uh, <laughs> that's my cat going insane, apparently. Sorry about that. The uh, it's, it's incredible what Kick is doing. I, I'm assuming this is just a start. Because they make a lot of their money through slots and casino, a lot of this gambling stuff, which is kind of kind of odd, sure. But they give the creators ninety five percent and take five percent. It's practically what uh, Patreon was to to start with, and that's that's pretty incredible. Just the host your your show now. I think this goes into kick a little bit more, but yeah, we'll we'll go into the next article about XQC. XQC hits back at Twitch, the Twitch staff criticizing his kick deal. The Twitch staffer's full message read, I think they need to build a better product before giant streamers at acquisitions. I think acquisitions first is putting the cart before the horse. That's a... Uh, if I open a restaurant with the bare minimum food quality or options, I don't spend $100 million on marketing before my product is there first. That is interesting to say, because I will agree that... Um, let me try to move this over, eh? It's not going to work. Sorry. That's just going to be a big white screen on the right. Uh, the It's interesting, because the app for Kick is pretty much garbage. It's pretty terrible. I mean, it's okay for iPhone at least. It it functions. You can't really do any of the like gift memberships, any any subscriptions, anything like that. You can't do that. But uh, I would say this platform's doing pretty well. Uh, I mean, I could just go to my channel, pull it up. I was playing Dark Souls the other night. Uh, it shows all your chats from previous times. My my boy Hoodie Alex, good good dude. And some people saying hello, you know, and and look, every, I'm only at one follower, sure, because I don't have a big presence, it's fine, but every stream, I have a couple people stopping in, that is entirely new, I've streamed on Twitch off and on for the last couple of years, I mean, man, probably 20, 2016 is probably around when I started, and I would only, like, at max, it was whenever I played maybe Jackbox games, I would have the best streams. So, it's interesting to see that there's a lot of hype around this new, this new platform. I, I really enjoy it. Uh, this is what XQC said about this guy. Acquisitions at first, but the cart before the horse. Acquisitions first. 
I'm going to start with Bam Bam Food Quality or Options. Pluto. Okay, Pluto. Then why the fuck um, did you take a job at the cart company then? If you're so worried about the horse. Yep. Because when you were on board Twitch, it wasn't the horse, was it? It wasn't a fully fledged product, was it? Nope. It was still, it was still a, a work in progress, was it not? Why do things have to be perfect? For it to be worth anything these days. Why does that have to be a, a, in their in their perspective? Things were good enough, right? And what not? And like like, what do you want from me? Want me to, you want me to fix a product overnight and and, and, and fix it up? And it's you, 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 you want me it's to, definitely not XQC's job. What? If he's gonna get an offer like that, a hundred million? Come on now, I'd do a lot of stuff for a hundred million bucks. Now, this is the latest. The latest thing I wanted to talk about came out just this morning. Pokimane. <sighs> why why y'all simping for these people? <laughs> I mean, come on. Uh, Dexter Toe. Pretty good news site. One of those previous articles was Dexter Toe. This is the lovely... Put that in air quotes. The lovely Pokimane responding to someone in her chat asking if you would take a deal for $10 million with Kick. Nope. Oh my god. She's shaking her- look at her shaking her head. And it's not because I got like $10 million. She's shaking her head more than Ray Charles used to shake his it's head. It's just because I'm good as I am. Why would I <clears throat> compromise my morals and ethics? For more money when I have money. Something about that is Morals and ethics. So okay. cringe to me personally. Like I, I understand, you know, if you if you need to make money. Right? Are you kidding me? From Ed, look, I, I guess she's definitely well off. With, without a doubt. A hundred percent. Well what is this friggin'? For me to do cringe shit. This is not all of this is cringe for me to do cringe shit This all of this Pokemon all of this is cringe like, ew. Uh, You thankfully can't see that but it says it's the uh, the lady g-spot Pinned by Pokemon. I don't get it This is this is embarrassing this entire thing so I wanted to end on that because what a joke man it's like she's she's jealous. She's jealous of XQC getting such a big deal. But anyway, uh, that's where I'm going to end the video now. And uh, hit the like, subscribe, all that stuff. I'm not on screen because I'm actually in the process of moving. Uh, so hopefully I can get more videos out when I when I can. <laughs> this might be the last one for a little while. We'll see. Uh, I'll, I'm going to be on kick as much as I can as well. So feel free to give me a follow over there. And... Uh, I will talk to you later. Have a good day, dear.